guys, it's me, Big Kato. Welcome to my favorite movies and series is, um, Countdown. I've never really done one of these before, so uh, apparently we're going to Batman. So, Batman, you know, the reason it made number 10 slot is because, um, uh, I, I didn't really like this. I loved the superhero, and I really, I kind of liked the movie, but the movie wasn't that great. Um, all of the movies, really. So that's why it landed number 10. What do we have for number 9? Number nine, we have Harry Potter. Um, Harry Potter, there is, it was a really good movie. They're really good acting, really good everything, but a little too much CGI for me. Uh, that's why it landed number nine instead of, like, number one. And that's why. Um, number, was that number, yeah, no, this is number eight, I think. Yeah, number eight. Um, Captain America, the first Avenger. The reason it's not just the Captain America series is I hated the second movie. I did not like the new suit. I didn't like anything about that movie. Um, so, yeah. Um, the re that's the reason I chose only the first Avenger. Because I thought the first Avenger was well done. Good acting. A really good story. And that's why I chose this. On to the next one. For number seven, we have Iron Man 2. The reason it's just not the Iron Man series. Because I didn't like Iron Man 1. Because it spent too much time in the backstory. Iron Man 3 I didn't really like because it was just kind of sad. I mean, I just didn't like it. But Iron Man 2, I love the Whiplash character. Um, I love the War Machine character. Um, and I really like the Iron Man suit. That's why this comes in for number six. Or number five. No, number six. Happy Gilmore. Um, this movie was just hilarious. This movie was just really, really funny. Um... It's about a golfer dude who gets really mad, and it's just hilarious. He's played by Happy Gil... Not Happy Gil. He's played by Adam Sandler, which is a hilarious person. And the acting was really good, so that's why it's just landed number six. Number five, Ride Along. Another really funny movie, but I think this one a little bit better on plot. Um, uh, yeah, I think this had a little bit of a better plot. Um... Also, Ice Cube, one of my favorite rappers in it. Um, I think it had a really good plot, um, really good acting, and it was also really funny all at the same time, and I loved it. Number four, Man of Steel. Superman, Man of Steel. Um, this, is, this is one of my favorites because it's my favorite Superman movie out of all of them. To me, it explains his backstory perfectly. Um, and it and the acting was just great. Um, Henry Cavill, I think it is. I don't know what his name is, but something like that. He was an amazing Superman. He's my favorite Superman. Um, I think they might have used every Superman ability. Uh, and the reason I'm not putting like a movie like Batman vs Superman on is because I didn't really like that movie. It was just kind of too emotional for me. So, no spoilers, by the way. Um... So that's why I just put Man of Steel, because Man of Steel is amazing. Um, I like the part where General Zod is battling Superman. No spoilers. Star Wars. Is this number two? If it is, well, I'm sorry if I messed it up. Um, Star Wars, the whole series was just great. The prequel series, they could have done a little bit better on, but I still loved it. Um, Darth Maul character was amazing. They had amazing battling. Um... To me, here's how, here's how it went down. So, the the prequel series was just action-filled and amazing. The um, original series was just kind of, like, emotional, but still really action-filled and plot-filled. Um, and then the seventh movie was just, was just, like, the plot and some action. And now, this is not number, that was, I think this is number three now. Ant-Man. No, this is number two now. Ant-Man. Um, I think they had a really good plot here. Um, really funny, too. I like the part when he got fired from Dunkin' Donuts. Oh, Dunkin' Donuts. Oh, his nose, man. Yeah, but I, I really like the acting here. Um, Ant-Man, I, I like the new costume better than the old one. I kind of do. Um, and it was emotional, plot-filled. Not too emotional, though. And, um, action... And just really drama and awesome. 
Okay, now one of my favorite ones, Marvel's Daredevil movie. So, the reason I chose this movie is, one, Daredevil is amazing. Two, it has an amazing plot. Just amazing plot. Three, um, he's kind of like my version, the better version of Batman. Because, um, he has, he's blind, but he has amazing hearing, X-ray vision, all that. Um, he also has an amazing baton. So, that's, that's, that's why Daredevil comes in number one. That, um, uh, the Kingpin character is great. All the acting was amazing. Ben Affleck as Daredevil was just an amazing decision. Um, that's my choice for the top ten. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Um, that was amazing. And hope to see you guys next time. And good, goodbye.